now I'm in here with the double drawer Sweeta. I took it off the base. It's just four bolts that hold it, but there was some sort of pin here for the drawer release, which I have no idea how to put back on. So this was all jammed up, and I believe the key to this is to get this out because it frees up that. So what I did to unjam it is probably not right, but it worked. I have a wrench that's seven eighths that fits perfect on there. It don't work so good when this is in because it hits on it. <coughs> and when I wiggled around this, loosened this bolt a little bit, just kind of, and then on this side, I don't want to take them completely, but I got it to, I got it to run, so I'm going to try to trip it. If I can. Alright, I tripped the machine. So now, I'm just going to use this to turn it. Very carefully. I got the Register the turn finally. And sometimes when you get right at the end, it's a little hard, but now the wheels are tight so it's been cycled. I'm going to try it again. Chirp the machine. Probably not the greatest thing to be doing, but and now it's back. So now my next job is somehow putting this cash register back together again. I have no idea. These teeth are a little messed up this one right here because all the screwdriver in there so I'm gonna see if I can get a new one of these but inside of this it's pretty cool as we'll show you while I have it out so I can get it up with one hand really nice in here. I don't know if you ever seen this. So look at those gears in there. It's like so this is the where the oil is down in there. That makes your oil bolt so it makes sense to have oil in there. So as this spins it just sends the oil around. And these are pretty good. I mean so they all go in there and then you have your bolt that goes down that does all the spinning. So this is pretty genius work here for the Swedens. Swedes, whatever they are. So that's that. So now I need help putting this back together again. I did manage to, I think, 
get the key banks back in the right way. These all press now, except some of these numbers don't press like that. I can get an A. I can't get any of the numbers to go if I really force them. Some of them, so they're probably not in right. And I need to get the release back in. I'm not sure if I have these in right. And I have this piece, I think, goes in there. I'm not sure. But when it does, see this right here, that when you press this, it pushes that. When this is in, lost a piece to it. When this is in, it gets hung up here somewhere and it won't go down. So, so I don't know if that's right. So I got it tripped again, I think. So I'm about to cycle it and see what happens, but this is where I'm at with this. So pretty decent, at least it's running. See ya.